welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be Christmas decorating and I am so excited. I have been in the mood to be Christmas decorating since before it was appropriate. So I am ready and excited. Um, I know it's still early but I really hope that you enjoy this video whether or not you're decorating along with me. So let's get into it. I'm gonna start out in the living room here. Definitely not gonna get it all in one video. I'm definitely not gonna get it done today. But I wanna start here in the living room because that is my absolute favorite space to decorate for Christmas. So let's pull out the tree. So this is actually my absolute favorite tree in the entire world. Um, it makes a huge mess, but I love it so much. Um, it's a seven and a half flocked pencil tree. Um, and I've had, so I have two of them. I have one in here and I have one in my bedroom. Um, so I've had one of them for three years and I've never had a problem. And um, yeah, I love them so much. So, and they're like a hundred bucks on Amazon. I will definitely link it for you in the bottom or in the um, description, I will link it for you in case you're interested. I decorate this tree in my living room kind of more um, just very aesthetically pleasing and you know creamy whites and stuff like that and then all of my more sentimental uh, ornaments and stuff like that I throw on our bedroom tree um, and anything that's special to me I put on my office tree and anything that's you know directly special to Gunner I put on his Christmas tree um, in his office so that's kind of how I do that um, I really love having just one tree that um, is just the most gorgeous thing in the entire world so uh, not that you know sentimental ornaments can't be beautiful but um, I like to have one tree that's just for the visual you know what I mean so that's what this tree is and I absolutely love it it's my favorite thing in the entire world And the 
this is also Nala's first Christmas and it just makes me sentimental just her birthday is on December 3rd and everything it just makes me uh, tear up a little bit but this wreath or these garlands I love them so much I used to have them on my stairwell when we lived in our townhouse um, it makes an absolute mess and it's Gunner's literally his worst nightmare but I love them they're so gorgeous and um, just beautiful so they have all these like little ice things on them and it just like looks like you drop salt everywhere so I have to go through and pick it all up with a vacuum later but it is just the most beautiful thing in the entire world And as you all know, sometimes life happens, so this is a few days later where I'm picking up right where I left off. Now, I always do this. I always end up adding more stuff to my Christmas tree. Um, I do like a pretty full Christmas tree, you know, stuffed with ornaments. So, I found a box of ornaments that I used last year and absolutely loved. Um, so, I, I don't know. I need to make a better system for all my ornaments because they're all just in that big uh, tote that I have. And these ones I kept in the box because they are fragile. So I always find the like ones that I bought on purpose and that are like super pretty um, and I want to make sure that I put on this Christmas tree and I always find them too late so I end up having to stuff them in here somewhere but yep that's what I'm doing. And since we bought Miss Nala last year after Christmas, we are going to have to find another stocking hanger and stocking. I'm really hoping that Target, because that's where I got these, I got these at Target last year. I am really hoping that they still have the same one that Ollie has, because otherwise that will absolutely drive me crazy. Keep singing what the season's all about. Good, good time. 
so all of my trees get tree collars except for this one because I put um, all the gifts under this tree um, and this is like way too big for a pencil tree I have yet to find a tree skirt that is for like specifically for a pencil tree uh, not to say that Amazon probably has one, you know, I haven't looked on Amazon, um, but anyway, so I just kind of scrunch this up to make it look, you know, the, the, that's how it's supposed to look, so letting the Roomba run, and this is it, this is officially done, and the big hole under my TV will have a fireplace in it, um, hopefully my husband is telling me by next weekend, so... Um, I will officially have a fireplace in there and not just a big old hole. So that's exciting news for maybe next year's Christmas clean and decorate with me. So be looking forward to that. And thank you so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe. I would love to have you and I'm really trying to grow this channel this year. So yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much. Bye. Santa's gonna come and join us in this song